Okay, okay. Okay. Yep. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, what's up, Dark Watch? <laughs> oh, yeah. It's got me. It's really hard, I think. We gotta go let the animals out. You know. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 Just like normal. Just come on around. What was that? Yep. Stretch it out. Ron, I see you. Still being you. Still being lazy. <laughs> Sheesh. Kitty cats. Stop following me around. Huh? Oh, crazy kitties. I'm telling you. It's crazy cats. I gotta let Avery out. Sheesh. Okay. Avery, she's taking care of. Sheesh. Watch these. Watch these cats. Watch them. I'm telling you, it's like a herd. Like, watch. See? Once they realize that I'm not going down that direction, normally they run like, go follow me. Watch. Yep. Here comes Cinder. Yep. See? Mm hmm. Hey, we're over here. Our food's over here. But you know what we gotta do first. You hear him? Don't get it. Oh, yeah, still good on water. Oh, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Shake him, shake him up. Yeah. Yep, yeah. flap them wings, shake them tail feathers. Yeah. Sheesh. Yeah. Man, you guys got some extra shakes in here today. <laughs> Let's take care of the chickens. Yep. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. So good on water. Yeah. We still should be good on food. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We got plenty of food. I hear you. I hear you in there. Oh, look at them. Look at them. They just, they're ready. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Hey. What's good? Teach food. Crazy. Crazy chickens. Go on, go on, go on. Let's do chicken things, come on. I just checked their eggs last night, so. Before I went to bed, we'll check them again when we get back. Eat. All right, watch this. All right, kitties, come on, kitties. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, hi, Ember. You just want to play, huh? Huh? You just want to play? There you go. Right, look, just, just wait. Watch Flint. No? Oh, Amber's the one. Can you guys move? I can't open that with you up on it. Wait. <laughs> Flint's always the one that gets the brunt of it. I'm telling you. There you go. Yeah. There we go. Boom. Okay. Rock in the yard. Come on, kids. Okay, guys. All right, animals taken care of. Right before we leave, we'll go. I'll let Timber out and put Avery back up. That'll be the plan for that. Yesterday, I think I, well, I didn't film all of it because my battery's almost dead. I tripped all four of those footholds at the property where all my traps are at. I tripped them all, reset them, put fresh dirt and stuff over them, and rebated them with some of that new stuff that uh, Minnesota Trapping Supplies sent me. So, I mean, hopefully, now that they're kind of freshened up, there's something on them. I'd like to be able to go and uh, I'll probably move those snares because they're not, I don't know. I don't even see any tracks over there, but I'd probably, I'll probably move them and then reset two more traps is probably what I'll do. I'd like to do three or four traps, but the ground is just a dang hard, man. I mean, I might, I might be able to in one of the spots I really want to set. So we'll see. I'm going to go inside. I'm going to have a cup of coffee. So we'll see you guys in a little bit. Yeah. All right, guys. Sheesh. We're finally, we're gone. We gotta go check traps, guys. Woo wee -ee. I'm gonna go check these out. Real quick, yesterday we went out, set off all the traps, set them all off, uh, took all the frozen dirt and stuff off of them, reset them with dry dirt and some fine powder. So all the traps that we're going to check have been reset and freshly baited and, and freshly lured up and stuff like that. We're gonna go see if we got anything. Um, that's where we're off right now. Hopefully, hopefully something came by and smelt the new scents and stuff that we got from Minnesota Trap Line and hopefully we caught something today. But uh, my wife took the kids to her sister's kid's birthday party. Um, so we have a little bit of time to do what we need. I got a lot of stuff to do around the house today. I've got to fix the chicken coop door. I've got to rebed everything. I got to move the duck coop to a different location. Um, we just got a lot going on. We did pre-order some new birds. So I've got I've got 12 more chickens coming. I'm getting the Buff Warringtons and the Sussex. I'm getting six of each of them, and then we actually ordered three, four, four 
Cayuga ducks. And I'm excited to get those in. I've, they're, they're pretty cool ducks, man. I'm, I'm actually pretty excited for that. Because this spring, I've got a different idea. I'm going to put out one of those uh, little kiddie pools for them to mess around in. They're going to have a lot more free range around the yard. All the ducks will. Uh, and then, you know, we're just going to go from that. But those come in in March. So I've just got to make sure I've got everything buttoned up and everything good to go. Got to get the heat lamps back down and the brooders and all that good stuff to make sure that those little chickies can uh because it's still going to be cold in march <clears throat> i mean it is what it is so and plus you even if it's not cold <laughs> you got to have them them heat lamps on them little on them little chickies so but yeah right now we'll see you guys in a little bit we'll go out and check these traps and then uh we'll go from there so she in a little bit hopefully we got something well i pulled in i didn't have anything on the first two and i still I don't think I have anything over here either, but I gotta get out and check these footholds. Yep, I can see that one, nothing on that one. This is insane. Guys, what the freaking heck? Maybe I oughta just stop trapping for the year. That seems like more of the logical thing to do. Damn, I can't believe this. I'm just not catching anything. So here's one foothold. Nothing on it. Well, some of the food's been taken down on it. Beavers. And there's the other foot. <clears throat> there's nothing on it. None of the food. And you can see the other. That orange deal right there. Ain't nothing on that either. Goodness gracious. That one actually had all the food ripped out of it. And it wasn't set off. Uh, maybe I need to... Those orange ones, they're new, or I just got those at the end of last year. So maybe I need to uh, set the tensions a little different on those. I don't know, but it is still cold. I know a lot of guys told me that, you know, the like raccoons and stuff like that, they, I mean, you'll catch them, I guess, every now and again, but they, it's better to, it's better to trap them when they're, when it's like nicer weather out. I got my other set right here. You just hush your freaking mouth. I'm driving 20 feet. Jeez. <clears throat> I've got the, uh, I want to see if anything stepped around it. There's nothing on it, but I want to see if anything stepped around it. Well, it doesn't even look like anything stepped around it. But she's still sitting there. I don't see anything bouncing around over there. Let's check my snare. I'm gonna probably I'm gonna pull these snares, I think. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna pull them. It, it, I'm not really seeing anything there either. Huh. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'll come back to pull those other snares, but let's drive down the... I got two more traps down the way. Let's see if anything got in those. I'm on just a big lull right now. I mean, I caught one raccoon. I've caught one raccoon in like a week and a half for two weeks. <clears throat> so, it's very disheartening. <laughs> just gotta keep going at it. Keep going at it strong, I guess. Yeah, I see nothing bouncing around up here either. Oh boy. Not even any footprints around that. And didn't guess, didn't think so. Gate's still open over here. So, okay, well, it is what it is. You just gotta keep rolling. I'm gonna leave those set. I'm gonna move those snares. I'm gonna take those snares to another property because I'm gonna reset the other two traps over on that other property. Yeah, we'll get those reset. So we'll see you guys at the next property. Okay guys, well, we are here. I'm gonna remake this set right here. Uh, I've caught, caught a couple coyotes off this. I'm gonna have to, actually no, I'm just gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna set it, make a compass set right here. And then I've got a trap down there. But I think I'm gonna take those snares and I'm gonna find a spot where I know the coyotes are crossing over. I might, I'm gonna try to find a spot along that fence line over there, so. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, that, don't need that. Need this, need this, stay tuned guys. My trigger was bent on that one, so that sucks. Had to get it bent back down. Okay, get some dirt here, get rolling. All right, guys, you guys, I might just, I'll show you guys the set after I'm done with it. But this is, uh, let me back up here. 
Whew, she was up tight, but this is what we got working here. And I'm gonna bed it a little bit better and then fluff it all in, put my pan cover on it and put my dirt holes, my dirt holes in it, my compass, put some scents in there, lures in there, and this one will be good. So I'll see you guys uh, when we're walking for, dang, that's a lot of freaking snow geese up there. Sheesh. All right, guys, we'll see you in a little bit. All right, something on my lens, I think. That's what it is. I got four dirt holes. Some guys use three. I'm just gonna use four. My trap's obviously right in the middle there. And I got four different lures in there. I think I use lightning in a bottle, war paint, Mississippi special. That's a cat lure, but I think you can really put any kind of lure in there. And then Violator 7 was the other one I used. So, yeah, oh, we'll see how it goes. I mean, only time will tell. I've caught two dogs there, but I haven't had that trap set for quite some time. I mean, I know there's a lot of dogs that run around here. I just haven't had the success that I've had at the other properties that I've been trapping. I need to find a spot along this fence row where coyotes and stuff might be running through here. Just give me a second, guys, and we'll be back with you in just a minute. Okay, well, I switched it up just a little bit. Um, I looked at my phone, I got, I got to get these shores done. Um, I didn't find any nice defined trails that I wanted to set those two snares on. I mean, I know there's some on the property, but I figure if I'm gonna set them, and I don't catch anything tomorrow, I don't want to just take them down. Well, of course, when I go back to freaking work, I, I, I don't have the time to walk all over all these properties to try and check all these traps. So I'd rather set those snares somewhere where it's accessible for me to, to get to relatively quick. <clears throat> so I just decided not to set the snares out on that property. Uh, I went ahead and re, obviously you saw the one that I reset. I reset the other one that I thought I wanted to move, but I got to thinking so many deer walk that far edge of the field that they probably would have set my trap off and I didn't want to waste my time. So I've caught a, I've caught one or two coyotes at that location that the other trap was at. So I just went ahead and reset it there, freshened up all the bait. That way I've got two traps set there. I gotta go get these chores done for the chickens, the ducks. If I have time when I get done with all those chores, I might run back out to the this third property that I've really yet to set anything on, minus a couple snares. And I might set those snares up over there. And I still have one foothold trap in the back of my truck that I can set somewhere. We'll see what the timing's like when I get done uh, doing all these chores. I'm, I'm guessing it's probably gonna take me about three hours probably to do all these chores. Yeah, we'll see where we're at from there. So you guys stay tuned and Either if we don't see you this afternoon later on doing chores, we'll see you in the morning checking traps. Peace.